If you've always wanted a pyramid but hate the sand, then you're still in luck since you can go ahead and get this one that goes on the water. Inspired by Mayan and Japanese architecture, these multi-level floating buildings are the basis around the idea for a floating city. It has 10 different floors and floats about 100 feet above the waterline. These floors create sections which overlap and sit on top of a floating basement that provides an entrance for boats to dock and people to enter the building. The surface of each section is covered in solar panels allowing the entire building to collect and store energy. Water turbines are also used for power, ensuring that each building will be entirely self-sufficient. While an entire city is a lofty goal, I would love to see it made into a reality. The project is set to be completed by the year 2022. For a more contemporary design for fun on the water, this is a new smartly designed houseboat built by Black Swan Marine. It is a 30 foot long houseboat intended to carry up to six persons. It's maneuverable over the waves using a 60 horsepower outboard gasoline motor. Dark brown and white wall panels are punctuated with large circular windows, which makes this boat especially eye catching. It's also fitted with a full-length top deck accessible from an exposed circular staircase. The boat features the latest in high-tech navigation tools in the cockpit as well as an MP3 player with Bluetooth. This unique floating island offers more than 10,000 square feet of living space and rooms up to 12 people as well as four staff members. It offers all the luxury of a hotel suite, plus a lot more, including a covered barbecue area and jacuzzi. The lower deck features a large entertainment venue with comfortable seating. Located on the main deck are an exotic aquarium, a large TV, a sunroof, a full kitchenette, a seating area, and a bar. The innovative design promises island living more comfortable than just about any luxury yacht at cost-effective purchase and maintenance. The island is also termed green because of its eco-friendly features, such as using excess energy to treat salt water to make drinking water. It is powered by a wind energy system, as well as solar panels making the most use of daylight. Nautilus has created the only holiday home you'll ever need with this two-story design. The first floor has the living area, kitchen, and a bathroom. The second level has the master bedroom and another bathroom. Ranging in size from 500 square feet to 1700 square feet, it comes equipped with a hanging stove, water and sewage treatment systems, and underfloor heating. A spiral staircase allows access to each level, including the roof, which can be used as a sun deck or space for solar panels. Multiple options and features are available for this one with a base price of around $220,000. The company also has a project development team that can build you a complete marina with included floating homes built directly on your shoreline from the water up. The aptly named Icon is just that, an icon for luxury houseboats. It has four bedrooms, each with their own bathroom. The open floor plan puts the kitchen, dining area, and lounge area all within view of each other without creating a cramped feeling. On the upper deck, there's another living area covered by a canopy with a spa that has room for up to eight people. It even has outdoor heaters just in case it gets a little too cold for your liking. Rental pricing depends on the season, with a three-day excursion running from around $2,300 to $5,400. This beautiful modern home will have passerbys staring as you light up the night sky. The catamaran-style single-level boat gives you the feeling of a New York-style loft, one in which the living room is directly connected to the dining and kitchen area, which is also connected to the bedroom. The sleeping area is separated with a partial wall to help maintain privacy. A sliding glass door leads to a back deck which offers the perfect viewing platform for those on the water sunsets. Although it's only 500 square feet, the open floor plan makes it feel much bigger on the inside. Pricing on this one will run you $250,000.
Hey everyone, don't forget to subscribe for more amazing content and ring that bell to stay up to date on all our latest videos. Living in the lap of luxury always comes with a price tag. Regarded as Britain's most expensive houseboat, the Matrix Island is no exception. A 1930s steel barge has been converted and reshaped into a mansion, creating 5,000 square feet of living space. It comes with five bedrooms, ensuring plenty of room for everybody on board sauna-style bathrooms, a floating fireplace in the lower level living area, and an outdoor deck are examples of some of the amenities it has to offer. The price tag on this one is currently $4.3 million. This catamaran houseboat combination is another entry that redefines the levels of luxury and comfort you can find on a yacht of comparable size. The 44 is the smallest of the six models currently offered by Overblue with 915 square feet or 85 square meters of living space. The open design of the flybridge houses the helm, a large dining table, and a galley which includes a mini fridge and a hidden wet bar with a sink, prep area, and a dual burner cooktop. A hardtop over this area provides protection from the elements while solar panels on top provide electricity as needed. Standard features include a master cabin at the front with a king-size bed and a dedicated bathroom while sliding doors open up to a private deck area which has an electrically controlled sun visor. The rear houses a lounge area with a large couch, a dining table, and another galley area which includes a full-size fridge, dishwasher, sink, and stove. Sliding glass doors lead out to a deck area with a staircase providing easy access to the flybridge. Pricing starts at around Number 10. Designed and built in Berlin, the Nautilus houseboats are bringing modern design to the waterfront. At two stories tall, it offers plenty of room on board. The first level has a living area, kitchen, bathroom, and bedroom. The second level houses the master bedroom and a large upper deck accessible by a curved staircase built right into the back of the boat. While the design of the beautiful floor-to-ceiling windows alone is enough to prompt a sale, the base model comes with a few extras including an electronic convertible roof, an integrated sound system, and LED lighting inside and out. Pricing starts out at around $230,000. Designed by Revo, the quaint Campy 280 has everything you need for tiny water home living. It gives off a rustic but contemporary style made by Sheepsmuglardi Holia Herevin in the Netherlands. It has sleeping space for two, a rooftop deck, and has the ability to be powered by solar energy. It has a steel body with a 9.9 .9 horsepower. Floor-to-ceiling windows help keep you open to the scenic dancing waves. A slightly bigger model, the 300, is available too, with a few finer interior options and navigation. UK designer and builder Turner Works are trying to create movement toward a new way to create sustainable living solutions. They are developing an open source blueprint for housing that is carbon neutral and self-sufficient that everyone can reproduce with plans available for download. The lightweight house can be supported on a variety of structures, including a base within a floodplain, on piles, or even on a floating pontoon.
Moat Manufacture has created a series of houseboats that are perfect for that lifestyle of traveling and living on the waterways. The modular design of the M4 allows for it to be made according to the needs of the owner. Standard features include a full-size bathroom with a stand-up shower as well as a kitchenette with a sink and dual burner cooktop. Outside space includes patio decks at the front and rear of the boat in addition to the roof which can be utilized for sunbathing or congregating with family and friends. There's also an optional slide that can be attached to allow for a bit of fun when you want to get off the boat and into the water for a change. Pricing on this one currently starts out at $147,000. Not only can you live on the water, but with this houseboat you can live off the grid. Offering a new take on the green lifestyle, this houseboat was made with passive design strategies in order to be self-sustaining. Using solar panels and wind turbines, the design allows natural heating, cooling, and ventilation, all while giving you control at the touch of a finger using smart home automation, which can be controlled via your smartphone. Sizes range anywhere from 500 square feet to 2,000 square feet based on the customer's needs. The base model has two bedrooms, a kitchen, bathroom, living area, and a patio-style upper deck for lounging. And with all its modern furnishings, this boat will definitely catch your eye. Pricing on these starts out at $115,000. Here's a refreshing idea. Movable hotel rooms on the water. Salt and water architecture and yacht design have a new project. The very first floating hotel with catamaran apartments. The floating hotel is based on two parts the central floating construction, and apartment catamaran units. Each apartment is an innovatively designed catamaran that can be easily separated from the dock and navigated. Moat Manufacture released a new premium houseboat which is perfect for a weekend getaway. This floating hotel room has a steel construction which is insulated and noise-proof. The intelligent engineering of the boat allows it to be made according to the needs of the user. The innovative modular design can be arranged into an apartment with sleeping for up to four, or you could have an apartment with an office in the back, or even a sauna. And let's be honest, we're all going to choose the sauna. It comes standard with eco-friendly features such as systems for clean water filtration and wastewater treatment as well as having a 25-year warranty so you know you're taken care of. Pricing on this one starts out at $150,000. Before you get washed away by these amazing houseboats, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click that bell icon to stay up to date on all our latest videos. With its advanced German engineering, Revhaus created this luxury penthouse floating home. This chic water fortress is about 2,002 square feet and has several floor-to-ceiling windows giving you expansive views. The rooftop terrace alone is 1,076 square feet, leaving plenty of room to dance and party. With a fully equipped kitchen, cooking for an army is no problem. The Rev can be spruced up more with underwater lighting for those showy types. For ultimate relaxation, you can add a sauna, hot tub, and fireplaces. I don't know about you, but I can totally see myself enjoying my next holiday break aboard the glamorous Rev. Modern and eco-conscious, the float wing is the ultimate getaway spot or the ultimate lake party house. Completely modular in design, the final product is decided by the owner. Sizes range from 32 feet to 60 feet in length and can have up to three bedrooms. Designed to be completely self-sufficient, the batteries can last up to seven days on a full charge. It has the option for a solar panel array to be mounted on the roof as well as having a water filtration system, fully equipped kitchen, and a pellet stove for warmth on those cooler days. Pricing starts out at around $250,000. 
Inspired by IKEA's modular furniture, this build-it-yourself boat may be more frustrating to put together than an IKEA table, but I promise it will be much more satisfying. With 10 different types of sections, you can choose how each space of your home will look. Each one is equipped with electric motors in order to reduce their carbon footprint. The standard unit includes a living area, kitchenette and dining area, bedroom, and bathroom, with everything being customizable down to the color. With the company offering designs for floating cafes, cargo transport models, and homes, the sky is the limit, or the ocean is the limit. Whatever floats your boat, or house. Pricing starts out at around $125,000. This first entry on the list is one of the few that has a walking deck with a safety rail surrounding the boat. High fives for that one. The front deck leads into a large carpeted living area with a couch, table, and the helm. This is connected to an open kitchen which has a stainless steel sink, a dual burner cooktop, and a 130 liter refrigerator with an inside freezer. The bedroom is in the rear with a queen sized bed and a door leading to the back deck. Next to that is a full-size bathroom with a large louvered window and an extra closet for storage. Stairs off of the rear deck lead to the roof which can be utilized as an extra terrace. It measures 538 square feet or 50 square meters so the sky's the limit on what you want to do up there. Pricing for this one will run you about $165,000. This floating home is marked by two huge two-story windows, which accentuates the transparent design of the house. The design keeps the floor of the living area close to the water level and the garden level behind. The home also features a full front deck and a second-story balcony overlooking the water. If you thought the underwater planters on the last houseboat were cool, then let's see how you feel about an attached coral garden. The master bedroom, positioned in the underwater level of the floating seahorse, offers just that, along with a giant window to view it all. Talk about an expensive aquarium setup. With three levels, there's plenty of room for the whole family. It comes with four sleeping areas, a large living area, a kitchen, two bathrooms, and heating and air. There's even an easy access ladder to get back on the boat after you enjoy your backyard swim session. There are three different options for this one with sizes ranging up to a little over 4,000 square feet. Pricing on these start out at around $3 million. Before we reveal our number one pick, we'd like to remind you to comment below and let us know which one is your favorite. Created by world-respected Bjarke Ingels, the Urban Rigger's purpose is to offer obtainable student housing. Made from recycled containers resting in a bay, the 8,019 square foot space has a community vibe to it, but still gives each person their private space. Its public areas really make the Urban Rigger unique with a green courtyard, green roof, roof terrace, kayak dock, bathing platform, and barbecue area. Downstairs is 12 storage rooms, shared kitchen, and automated laundry. Each of the 12 bedrooms is around 247 square feet. Sustainable and eco-positive energy is used, provided by solar panels and hydro source heating. And the insulation is recycled aluminum. Its interior is clean, but has a trendy modern feel. And being located on the water, you get views that are sure to inspire. Especially if you're a student that's studying hard and looking for a little extra spark. Still in their design phase, the Yacht House 40 and 70 look to be an enterprising and modernly alluring pair of houseboats. A charming island kitchen or bar appear to be a quality feature in the making of this luxury yacht house as well. Being produced by Sheeps Meglardi Holieth Hendrik Bolthozvig in the Netherlands, we'll be excited to watch the development of these designs. Covered in copper panels and local timber, the Park Ark in the Netherlands is placed on a canal next to a 17th century park sporting a contemporary exterior. 
Designed by BYTR Architects, the Park Arc was built with glass roofs, a sunroof, and a deck offering engagement with nature and the views surrounding. An open floor plan with white walls helped give this boat home a spacious interior, and a corner fireplace gives it that cozy home sweet home vibe. French oak floors run through the living space with red cherry wood cupboards in the kitchen. Windows are placed at unique angles and dotted to keep nosy neighbors from peering in. Completely state-of-the-art and completely gorgeous, the Waterloft is one of the best-looking houseboats on the market. Made from recycled and reclaimed wood, it's extremely environmentally friendly. One of the options adding to its self-sufficiency is the ability to include solar panels to power your air conditioning, washing machine, television, lights, and kitchen appliances, as well as charging a battery for use even when the sun goes down. The entire boat is surrounded by floor-to-ceiling glass windows for a stunning view in every room of the house. There's even an option for a basement to be included in the houseboat. This allows you to be on the water for as long as you want and still feel like you're in any house built on land. Pricing on this one starts at $1.2 million. Although this list harbors a variety of shapes to each one, there's still something to be said for the shipping container shape of this houseboat. Measuring just under 39 feet or 11.8 meters long and just under 16 feet or 4.8 meters wide, it has enough room for a family of four. A large sliding glass door provides entrance to the lounge area, which has a fireplace, the steering unit, and a staircase leading to the roof as standard features. Behind that is the dining room and a full-sized open kitchen. A hallway leads to the rear where you'll find a full-size bathroom and the main bedroom which also has a sliding glass door that opens to the outside. Additional access to the roof is available via a ladder attached to the outside front of the boat. Just outside the living room is a small adjustable terrace area that can lower below the water line for easier access to the water and retract into the hulk of the boat when not needed. Current pricing on this one will run you around $285,000. This quaint little wooden cabin looks like it could be tucked away in the mountains with its walls of cedar and plywood, but it is ready for the open water. The Le Coruc was designed by Quebec boat builder Dagno. You can pick either of two models. The P-Series version is set up for fishing, and the V, or holiday version, is decked out for a weekend of relaxation. This model is the larger of two available with a 30 by 10 foot deck, a large front open patio, and large sliding glass doors. It has solar panels for electric power and is moved by using an outboard motor on the rear. This one is a crossover of a houseboat and a yacht, and that's exactly where it gets its name from. Made of molded fiberglass, the boat measures 49 feet. It can come with up to four bedrooms, offering plenty of room for you and your friends. The upper deck, which can be covered with an optional canopy, has seating for up to 14 people. There's also a built-in sink, grill, and fridge for all your needs when it comes to socializing on the water. It also has hidden storage built into the floors, providing extra room for those refreshing beverages. While you're daydreaming about your next on the water adventure, be sure and let us know in the comments your preference for seaside living. If you have a love for the life forms that live in the deep, then this houseboat may be your dream home. Hidden from sight, the underside of the boat is covered in planters which create habitats for fish while helping to purify the water at the same time. The basement has a large window allowing the occupants to observe the underwater creatures without even having to get their feet wet. On the other hand, the inside is a little less fishy. With a very modern and spacious design, this boat is as gorgeous as it is functional. It uses the water around it for heating and cooling as well as having a rooftop solar array that provides power to the home. Unfortunately, this one is privately owned and the owners have plans to keep it. 
but considering how awesome it is, you've got nothing to lose by making them an offer. With its unconventional roof and moon-shaped curves, the Fennel Residence by Robert Harvey Oshatz gives an enthusiastic appeal to living on the Willamette River shores. The curved wood is meant to mimic the flow of the river, completely immersing its occupant in the tranquil element of water. It's almost like you're walking into a modern art museum. This 2,364 square foot floating home has an urban loft-like feel to its interior. The bottom level is an open common area with kitchen. Small cubicles rest at the back, perfect to store the captain's wine or other collectibles. Definitely one of the more inventively stylish floating homes that we've come across. The Port X is composed of several modules. You can add on as many modules as you like. French windows and skylights give a lively ambiance of natural light while floor convectors heat the separate spaces. Production of this unique floating home takes place in the Czech Republic and is claimed to be completed within six months. Wood floors are a standard while adding on cool features like a sauna, shading system, outdoor heated pool, fireplace, or an all-glass lobby. Allow one to spruce it up top-notch. If you'd like to test the Portax out before buying it yourself, visit Prague and stay in theirs. Uniquely Dual, this floating getaway by National Park de Beesbosch in the Netherlands offers an intriguing retreat. Over half of each floating unit is covered in glass for a full view of the enchanting waters. There's a comfy deck up top where you can join your other mates, be it bird or man. And further up the spiral staircase is the crow's nest for even broader views. Wondering if you spotted a solar panel up there? You sure did. Natural energy at its finest. The interior is clad in timber inspired by the Nordic designs with saunas to give more of that warmth feeling. The sleeping space is in the opposite unit with the same amount of window viewing. What else could you want with dual spaces and trifocal leveled views? manufacturer released a new premium houseboat which is perfect for a weekend getaway. This floating hotel room comes standard with eco-friendly features including systems for wastewater treatment and clean water filtration. It's made according to the needs of the owner with a modular design that can be arranged into an apartment with sleeping for up to four or an apartment with an office in the back or even a sauna. And let's be honest, we're all going to choose the sauna. Pricing on this one starts at $150,000. This 75-foot yacht-style houseboat is a monster. The Bravada GT, also known as the Triple Decker, has 4,400 square feet filled with the best of the best. In fact, this boat is so big you can use the lower deck to dock another boat. Its three stories come with up to nine bedrooms and five bathrooms based on the package you choose. But even the base package comes with two full kitchens, integrated sound and lighting systems, a built-in grill, and nine flat-screen TVs. Yeah, you heard me right. I said nine. The third level is custom designed to your liking with the option of a glass fire pit and hot tub, because nothing defines being out on the water like a hot tub in your boat. Pricing on this one starts out at $1.3 million. Located in Thailand, these structures were designed as part of the X2 River Kwai project. Each one measures 1,184 square feet or 110 square meters and is composed of a lightweight steel framework clad with plywood and fiber cement siding. Each unit was constructed off-site and towed into place upon completion. Each one was placed to maximize the view of the river while minimizing the amount of sunlight that enters it. Additionally, aquatic plants were replanted around the site to aid the surrounding ecosystem. Each unit includes its own water filtration system, a bathroom with a stone tub and enclosed stand-up shower, a mini bar, and a bedroom. 
Sliding glass doors open up from the bedroom to a balcony which has steps that lead up to the roof which can be used as an extra terrace. Information for pricing on these is non-existent. If anyone can find anything, feel free to leave it in the comments. I'm kind of curious to know myself. While you're trying to figure out how to attach pontoons to a double wide trailer, be sure and hit that subscribe button and click that bell icon to stay up to date on all of our latest videos. This houseboat is becoming more and more popular as a home choice in Amsterdam. With its beautiful design inside and out, I'd probably choose to live in one. And it's in Amsterdam, so there's that too. Three stories of sleek, ultra-modern design make this an easy choice for the top of our list. On the lower level, you have two bedrooms, one measuring 84 square feet and the other measuring 154 square feet. The middle level has a large open kitchen and dining area with sliding glass windows leading out onto a deck area. The upper level has a large open floor plan that you can set up however you want as well as another outdoor deck area. It comes standard with a full kitchenette including a fridge, stove 